Hello guys, do you want to create a stunning product motion graphics in After Effects? In this tutorial, I'm going to show you step by step how to animate a chocolate product with dynamic effects. We're going to be using a simple gradient cycle to create a stunning motion background. We're going to add a floating particle effect using CC ball action. I'm going to show you how to simulate explosive fluid effect with additional dripping liquid simulation using CC smear. And how to add style to your motion graphics using text animation and dynamic camera movement. So let's get started. Please help him get to 10k subscribers this year. Create a new composition with your own preferred settings. Use the ellipse tool to create a cycle. On the timeline, right click on the shape layer, add a gradient overlay from layer style. Expand the gradient overlay option. Set your style to radial and edit your colors. Make copies of the gradient cycles, stack them in different sizes and then Add a drop shadow from the layer style for depth. Adjust the drop shadow parameters to your liking. Now let's add the floating particles. Ctrl N to create a new composition. Then right click, go to new and then create a solid layer. Go to Effect and Presets and add CC Ball Action to this layer. Increase the grid spacing. Reduce the ball size to 3. Adjust the scatter properties and keyframe the twist angle to create a subtle particle movement. Add a camera and controller. Keyframe the Z position of the camera controller to give the particle a more dynamic floating. Back to the main composition, add the floating particle composition below the first shape layer on the timeline. Animate the scale property of the gradient shape layer to finish the background. Import the product image, arrange them on the timeline and add a position keyframe animation. Duplicate the top chocolate layer, you will need it later. Then add shadow to the product and set the layer track mat to the top shape radiant cycle. Go to Effect and Preset, search for CC Mr. Mercury and add it to the product image you duplicated earlier. Adjust the radius X to 60 and radius Y to 120. Adjust gravity to negative 1 and change the animation to fractal explosive. The lower the number of the gravity, the slower the explosion. Now, let's add a dripping effect to the chocolate seed. Go to Effect and Preset and search for CC Smear. You're gonna need to adjust the settings to get your desired effect. For more details, I already made a dripping effect tutorials. You can find it on the card above. 
right click on your timeline go to new and add a text layer for branding apply opacity and position animation let's finish things up like a professional select all the layers and make them 3d except the floating particle layer then right click on your timeline and add a camera and controller keyframe the z position value to give it a subtle camera movement and that is it guys in this after effect project tutorials you have successfully created a professional looking product MoGraph animation if you find this tutorial useful hit the like button subscribe to the youtube channel and then check the next video on the card it is going to show you how to create a seamless MoGraph transitions so until i see you again on the next one my name is ssb otaru from motion digit studios